Hello, uh, my name is Peter Dean from the sales team at School Cloud. Uh, and the purpose of this video is just to briefly go over uh, both the parent and the uh, teacher side of how video conferencing works. Also, show you how to activate it from the administrator side as well. Um, so as you can see at the moment, uh, I'm logged in as a parent as if I was on a mobile device. So you can see the screen is slightly adjusted um, and I have an upcoming appointment. So it will show up like this. It says you have an upcoming appointment and you can click join video appointments. Uh, if I do so, then we can see at the moment that uh, we've got my, it's picked up my webcam, uh, which I can turn on or off here. Um, it will ask for permissions when you go to the page in the first time and you can just hit allow. You don't need to download anything separately. It is just contained within the browser. Um, and you can see you've got, you know, the mute function or not here as well. At the top, I can see my next appointment and it's counting down when that's going to happen. I can see the name of the teacher as well as the relevant class or club that it's tied to. Um, the schedule as well will show all the appointments I've got coming up if I have multiples of them. So at this point, we're just waiting for the uh, appointment to be ready and then I can click in to join. So if I hit start appointment, then I can join the call and then got our uh, teacher that we were talking to there. Um, so you see it counts down 20 minutes total uh, for the actual meeting. Uh, this will automatically cancel once the time is finished. If I say, for example, accidentally close the call or refresh the browser or something like that, I can always reconnect. So it says to reconnect, you can press the green call button um, and then we're back again quite quickly. So that's all good there. Um, so that, that's the process for how things work.